everyone and welcome back to more political chatter. In this video, we will be talking about Nikki Haley and her and her uh, presidential campaign that she announced what 5 days ago now and how um I believe she is being highly underestimated by um by most people in the uh you know, in the political universe. Most people are um labeling her as a Two percent in Iowa kind of person. Uh, she won't get very far. Maybe drop out after Iowa or New Hampshire. So, um, so this video is about how I do not believe that that will be the case. I think that she will surprise a lot of people, or uh, at least she has the chance to surprise a lot of people. Um, so, uh, this Fox News article uh, says it best. Nick Haley not to be underestimated in bid for president, former South Carolina GOP officials say. Oh, um, I forgot to pull something up, but, um, in, uh, I mean, the rallies and town halls that Nikki Haley is bringing, maybe we can, uh, find a picture here, um, but the rallies that she is holding are not disappointing at all, um, as you uh, have probably seen in my community posts. They are always filled up, and the supporters are passionate. I've seen multiple people who are not fans of Nikki Haley on social media say, wow, this was bigger than I was expecting, and they actually seem enthusiastic. Maybe she won't do as bad. Um, and that's in New Hampshire, where, you know, the majority of people in New Hampshire do not know who Nikki Haley is, right? Um, you know, she only just announced her bid for the presidency. Maybe there's a picture. I, I know you guys have seen pictures of a rally, but maybe there's a picture um, on her Wikipedia page. Um, but um, they were not disappointing at all. As I said, seems uh, the, her supporters seem enthusiastic, and she is drawing big, uh, large crowds. Um, additionally, like, we have had people... Um, I, th this list is not a um, a big list of endorsements for Nikki Haley. Um, however, she did she just like five days ago announced, so it will get bigger. But Don Bolduc, who was only one because you know he was so loyal to Donald Trump because of his affiliations with Donald Trump, you would think that. Oh, he ran for Senate, by the way, in 2022, lost to Maggie Hassan. You would think that Don Bolduc would endorse Donald Trump, right? No, Don Bolduc came out and endorsed Nikki Haley in New Hampshire. New Hampshire, such an important state. Um, You need it to win. Well, that's not true, but, um, you know, most nominees have won New Hampshire. Ralph Norman, you know, the South Carolina endorsements don't really mean anything because it's South Carolina and everyone's from South Carolina. But, um... But, yeah, it was Phil Green, I don't know. Um, but anyway, Nikki Haley has gotten those endorsements already. But I really think that the key to Nikki Haley winning the Republican nomination in 2024 is the governor of New Hampshire, Chris Sununu. Um, this is my first time uh, saying this. Chris Sununu, I feel, really aligns with Nikki Haley when it comes to political positions. They are both more on the moderate side or traditionally conservative side of the Republican Party. Um, and they really agree on everything from economics to uh, culture wars. So, Chris Sununu is extremely popular in New Hampshire. He won re-election this year by an, an astounding margin. Um, and I could really see Chris Sununu endorsing Nikki Haley if Chris Sununu doesn't run him, himself. I could see Sununu running himself. But, um... If not, I really could see him endorsing Nikki Haley. And with that endorsement in New Hampshire, she is a serious contender, okay? I, I think that Chris Nunu would be more likely to endorse Haley than Ron DeSantis if Ron DeSantis gets in the race. Um, and then it's really a three-way race between Haley, Trump, and DeSantis in New Hampshire. Trump probably doesn't win. It's a comp competition between Haley and DeSantis, and it's honestly a free-for-all. In New Hampshire at this point, um, New Hampshire could decide the president. I honestly don't think that Iowa will mean all that much. But anyway, yeah, so if Chris Sununu, um, does endorse, uh, Nikki Haley, then, you know, Nikki Haley has a real shot at winning the presidency. So thank you all for watching this video. Make sure to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. That would mean a lot to me. 
and I'll see you all next time. Thanks again. Vote Phil Scott for President 2024.